Welcome to a brief introduction on Gale eBooks, one of the databases available through the Saracoso Community College Library. Gale eBooks is, as you might expect, a database that contains eBooks. In this case, it contains over 100 reference books and encyclopedias on a variety of subjects. To access the Gale eBooks database, head to the library homepage at saracoso.edu library, click on Databases, then scroll down to see Gale eBooks in the online reference shell. We won't cover it here, but you can also access Gale eBook titles individually through the library catalog. To access library resources off campus, you'll need to be a current student or employee at Saracoso. Then just log in with your college email and password. Once you're in the database, you can see the search box at the top and all the individual eBooks down below. They're grouped by subject, so you can jump straight to one if you need to. For now, let's search for something in the search box. Start with one or two keywords. And as you can see, the database recommends topics as you type. When you're ready, click the magnifying glass to run the search. This pulls up all the articles that mention your keywords across all the different encyclopedias in this database. Look below each title to see the name of the encyclopedia where the article is coming from. This will give you an idea about what that article might focus on. You can also see the publication year, the number of pages, and the beginning of the article's first paragraph. Note that you can use the sidebar options to filter your result by subject, document type, and a variety of other options. This can come in handy when you have a lot of results to sort through and you need to narrow it down. Click on a title to see the full text of the article. You can scroll down to read it, or you can listen to it and check out the sidebar to see similar articles and related subjects. The bar at the top features other things that you can do with the article. For example, you can send the article to yourself by email or save it to your Google Drive or OneDrive. You can also download this article. PDFs often preserve the original formatting, which can include page numbers and photographs. The Cite tool is another handy feature it automatically generates a citation in MLA or APA. These aren't always accurate though, so you'll want to check the citation before you paste it into your research paper. If you need any help finding articles or using the database, head back to the library page, where you can find links to librarian assistance through email, Zoom, chat, and more. We look forward to seeing you soon.